The time is now. At no other time in human history have we had the technology, the know-how, and the public excitement to get humans to Mars. We're building Orion today, right now, a spacecraft like no other designed for deep space exploration. But to get humans to Mars, we can't send Orion by itself. It, it needs to be part of a larger system that provides the supplies and the, the scientific equipment needed for a three-year journey that will take us hundreds of millions of miles away. We call our concept Mars Base Camp. Mars Base Camp is really straightforward. Let me break it down for you. It's an orbiting mission with four main sections and two of almost everything for backup. We have four large commercial solar arrays to generate electricity and power the spacecraft. For propulsion, we have two cryogenic propulsion stages and two tank farms to store the fuel, liquid oxygen and liquid hydrogen. Of course, the six astronauts will need room to live on their thousand day mission so Mars Base Camp has two habitats and a living space to eat, sleep, and exercise. Most importantly, we have Orion. It's the command deck with all the avionics for navigation and communications. Orion makes the whole spacecraft more reliable and gives the astronauts a safe ride home. Because we've already started, we think we can launch this system in about a decade. Orion is already flight proven, and we are designing the DSpace Gateway today. Soon, NASA and Lockheed Martin will launch an uncrewed Orion on the Space Launch System rocket for a mission called Exploration Mission 1, or EM1, to check out all the systems over three weeks in an orbit around them. After that, the next Orion flight, EM2, will be crewed. And on that launch, the SLS rocket will also carry the first elements of the DSpace Gateway. The DSpace Gateway is essentially a space dock where America and other spacefaring nations can perform revolutionary science and establish a lunar commercial economy. Through the 2020s, we will work with NASA to operate and assemble the DSpace Gateway and then build up Mars Base Camp and get it ready for flight. Finally, we will be ready to send humans to Mars, aboard Mars Base Camp. We've talked about how we can do it, now let's talk about why. Mars Base Camp is about more than humanity's greatest adventure. It's about science, answering fundamental questions that scientists have been asking for hundreds of years. Where did we come from? Where are we going? And are we alone? From orbit, astronaut scientists have access to the entire planet's surface for rovers and drones to make real-time decisions about where to go and what to examine. We can retrieve a sample from the surface for study, and we can send the astronaut crew to the two nearby moons of Mars for an up-close look. And from orbit, we can confirm the site selection for the first human landing. At Lockheed Martin, we've been exploring Mars with NASA from the beginning so we know what it takes to get here, how to operate here, and how to lead the world in doing it. Yes, Mars Base Camp is a concept, a vision, if you will. But whether it's this system that gets humans to Mars or something similar, the world is at a point in time where it has the, the means, the ability to write a new chapter in history, sending humans to the red planet.